It will not always show up the exact way that you want or that you really wish for it to. Sometimes your goals manifest in different forms than what you're expecting. When I first started motivational speaking, my idea, the vision that I had, the dream and the goal that I portrayed in my head was one where I was on stage talking to hundreds of thousands of people. I had to be on this platform, on this podium, and everybody was looking up to me and saying, wow, he's so great. However, it came about in a very different way. Only about a week after I had this vision, I got in touch with a motivational channel that had quite a large audience. At the time, it was about 10,000 people, but the video that we made together reached now, by now, over 400,000 people. And that was my first speech, and that was my first effort where I saw this dream, I saw this vision, and it became real. But it became real in a very different way than what I expected it to. See, many ways we get caught up in the how. So we have a vision, we have a dream, and we're caught up in exactly how it will look. We want it to be this way and that way, otherwise we are not satisfied and we are not happy. And what you don't realize is that the universe is often handing you everything that you want on a silver platter, except it doesn't look the way that you expected it to, and so you smack the universe's hand and say, no, I don't want any of that. And you quit and you give up and you say, I didn't reach my goal and I can never do that. And obviously it's not for me because it's not working. Well, maybe it's working, but not the way that you expected it to. Maybe it is actually happening. Maybe the result is there, but because you have an ego that's so caught up in seeing it exactly play out the way that you want it to, you can't actually enjoy the great results. Many times in relationships, we put this ideal on the other person. We want them to act a certain way. And all you really wanted was somebody that truly loved you. But now because you're expecting them to act a certain way, you can't tell that they're in love with you, that they really care about you because you're too busy looking at what's wrong with the way that they're presenting that. You want it to be a specific way and that's what's wrong. The problem is not that you're not getting results. A lot of the time the problem is that you don't even realize. You don't even know. You're not even aware that you are getting what you want. You are breaking through. You are making progress. It's just showing up a little bit differently than what you expected it to and that's what's throwing you off. So change your perspective. When you have a goal, when you set a vision, five years from now, ten years from now, what you want in your life, don't expect it to show up exactly as you asked for it. Just know that it will show up. If you do the work, if you put in the time, if you're willing to dedicate the energy that's required to create a result similar to this, you will have something that looks like what you want, but you have to be open to receiving too. Because many people, they do the work, they do the work, they do the work, and they receive, but then when it's receiving time, they block off. They can't receive, and what happens then is that they don't wanna give anymore. They don't wanna work anymore. They don't wanna put in the time because they didn't receive the way that they expected to, and now they're caught up and I didn't get what I wanted, and so I give up. So what have you received? Maybe all you wanted to do when you started was to change one person's life. Maybe you just wanted to impact two people. Maybe you just wanted to help your mom or your dad, or maybe your kids, or maybe you just wanted to have a positive influence on the environment. Well, perhaps you've already achieved some of that. Maybe you've hit some of those goals. Maybe some of the things you set out to do, you've accomplished them. But because you're constantly looking forward, because you can't really accept and feel what's happened for you and have the gratitude, being thankful for what's coming your way, for what you've put in, you're blind to the result. You don't even know that you're winning. You don't even realize that you're breaking through. You don't even realize how amazing you are because you're too busy bashing it and manipulating it and wanting it a certain way. And it's always this want, 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 and I can never have enough. And no matter what I do, and no matter how perfect it is, it just, there's always more. You get the phone, you're like, oh, I got the phone, and then it's, I need this. Oh, you affected somebody positively, but that, I don't really feel it. You wrote, and, and, and it reached 10 million people, and you can't even feel that it made a difference. Are you putting in the work? Are you getting a result? Are you accepting that result with your whole heart? saying, you know what, I did good, I deserve this, and this is amazing. It might not be what you expected it to be, but it's what you earned, so enjoy it.